When a typical New Canaan student thinks about a spring pastime, longboarding isn't the first thing that would come to mind. But for juniors Henry Holbrook, E.J. Jones, and Kelsey Rowley, it's the ultimate weekend activity. Through this unique and under-acknowledged sport, many kids have found themselves in parks and on hills all over town. Together, they learn how to longboard and find new tricks to practice. This sport has not only given many students the opportunity to become active, but it has together. also brought many groups of friends together. Um, we kind of found each other. Uh, I knew Henry and EJ had longboarded before, and when we were in middle school, we thought it was a cool thing to do. We brought our boards to school. We felt like those really cool kids. Um, we boarded into town on those awesome Fridays that we loved, and uh, we would just kick around and play and do some tricks. It was awesome. According to Henry, there is no right way to start longboarding. He himself owes his start in longboarding to YouTube. I got into longboarding after I saw a video on YouTube uh, from Original Skateboards, and it's, uh, it's, it's an awesome video, and it's just kind of like inspired me to longboard. My friends backed me up on it, and we just all saved up and bought longboards. It's great. Kelsey began longboarding after her brother introduced it to her. Um, the first time I really started longboarding was my older brother, who's in college. He introduced me to the sport, and it was so much fun, and it was such a bonding experience for the two of us. We really were able to connect, and I learned from him, and it's just now for me, it's like that time where I can be by myself, even when he's not here, and just think about him and be able to connect. While performing tricks is more common on the skateboard, many longboarders have also incorporated these moves into their ride. Um, well, just kind of uh, a lot of a lot of watching videos. Uh, major longboarding companies have uh, all the people that are sponsored for their companies. Um, they come out and they ride all the time. They're constantly coming out with new different things that you can do on the different boards, and to just kind of bring a balance between learning learning stuff from the skateboards and taking it over to longboarding. Just even stuff like being able to jump in the air, doing different kinds of tricks, and just thought I would combine the fun of riding longboards with being able to do tricks that uh, you can do on normal skateboards. According to Henry, what makes longboarding special is its lack of guidelines and rules. So longboarding comes in like a lot of different forms. There's not just one way to do it. So it's like what's special about longboard is that you can make it your own. You know, it's not it's not anybody else's sport except for yours. Like there's always something changing in the sport. That's what makes it so great.